Let's go ahead and upgrade the celestial body, guys. Once you log into Lunite, type column, column, refer, and then enter the code LENO in order to get yourself the juiciest starters, guys, that you can imagine on the biggest custom RSPS, guys. As you can see, we got some massive gains already. And for today's episode, we're gonna be fucking getting it, guys. I'm telling you, I'm putting so many grinds in right now into Lunite. I have so much fun playing this account. But before we're gonna get started, I'm giving away a diamond pack giveaway to one lucky winner and all you gotta do in order to know this juicy giveaway is to like this video be subscribed to my youtube channel with your post notifications on and as well comment your lunar in-game username Let's kick off the grinds on Lunite, guys. Yes, sir. We have right now seven dark attachments. We need to get 40 of these guys in order to be able to get our upgrades. And we're going to check out the collection log really quick. So as you can see, 15,000 KC. And we are going to get started now to farm many, many more dark attachments too. So most likely, guys, I will see you again once we reach the 40 attachments. And then we need to get 40 bloods and 40 light attachments as well. So it's going to be a hell of a grind, but it should be worth it, guys, because we want to get ourselves the Celestial Armor done. So, boys, we have actually managed to get these done. I did not record much because, I don't know, it's just the same thing over and over. So I'm just going to show you the collection log. As you can see, we're 23,000 KC, 46 Dark Attachments in the building, plus the Dark Shards that we got. That is going to bring us to 40 Dark attachments that is absolutely magnificent to see guys and we got the other attachments ready as well so what i did guys i, I spent over 400 million pbm tickets guys on the supreme attachments you can let me know if that is the right thing to do or not but we got ourselves the light and the blood attachments in the building guys so uh yeah the pvm ticket shot i spent all of my pvm tickets here on the supreme attachment and yeah we got ourselves all of the other attachments done as well so now it's time to actually create the celestial attachments oh my god i'm so excited guys you have no idea so without further ado guys i've spent so many hours on the vid but i've just noticed the vid is so short right now uh we are going to go ahead and create ourselves the celestial attachments we need the 25,000 celestial energy times four and i think i'm gonna create the full set guys because we will eventually need the Celestial Head, guys, for the Zalcano Armor, which is obviously the next insane huge upgrade that we need. So that is the plan for now. But I will only wear the body, guys, because my Evil Bunny ears are better than the full Celestial set together. So let's go ahead and make it happen, ladies and gentlemen. That is so freaking nice to see. So where is the Misk? There we go, Celestial. Upgrade. Let's go ahead and upgrade them all at once, guys. We have created four Celestial attachments. And that means that we're going to be able to create now the body. We need another 25 Celestial, 25,000, another 25,000, or 50,000 more Celestial energy. And that is pretty much going to rinse my Celestial energy, yeah. This is going to be it. We need to go back to the Sally runs, but with the new update, it's a lot easier to get Sally. So that is nice to see. Let's go ahead and upgrade one body right now, boys. So as of right now, guys, I realized I only have one Mystic Helm U, but I've got all of the plate bodies that we needed. And since we're not going to use the helm as of now, I'm just going to save uh, that for a later point. So let's go ahead and upgrade the Celestial body, guys. And there we freaking go. Ladies and gentlemen, holy shit. We look already a lot fucking better guys i can tell you that the grinds freaking paid off i love to see it holy shit guys we look so freaking good oh my god that's so nice to see and of course lots of the upgrade tokens guys came from the donator shop um i went ahead and spent all of my cash on case keys and sold them so yeah that was very nice as well but Look at us, guys. Major, major upgrade. And we are in our all grinds, guys. And of course, we want to go ahead and get ourselves some items today finally done. So after getting these massive upgrades in, let's go ahead and check out our collection log where we at. Here's our collection log. And we are going to take a look at the mini games right over here. No, the bosses, guys. What am I saying? The Zamorak one. We need to get ourselves the Relic of Zamorak and the Infernal Orb, guys. So we're at 
461 elite KCs. Let's see if we're going to be able to get some of these done. So we're at 470 KC. And this is what looks like. Relic Helm of Saradamine only. Hopefully we're going to get some better drops soon. Oh, we got ourselves a godly pot. KC 3,148 godly pot. But it's nice at least to see my name here. Alameo. Well, we got a $5 bond from a Guardian. I will certainly take that. KC 645. 485 KC out of the way. Let's see what we're going to get. 200% drop rate and nothing else. Nice. But actually the dopest thing is that you can create all boosters now. With six booster fragments. And we have reached the 490 KC now, guys. And still no Zami drop whatsoever. But that's fine. We're getting closer to the 500 and a lot more than that as well. I really want to get a drop today. Fresh Leno has received a diamond casket. Diamond casket drop is what we got. And let me tell you, that is not what we have been looking forward to get. But all right. No, no. We got the Sardom in God's word. <laughs> this can't be true. How do I keep getting Sardom in drops? This is so fucking surreal. Well, that's a cool milestone. 500 done. 500 out of the way. Uh, elite ones. But of course, only Sardamine drops. Nothing changes there. Would you look at that, guys? KC 511 Infernal Boast of in the building, guys. That is such a huge drop. You love to see it, guys. There we freaking go. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a huge drop that is going to splur in some nice cash. And yeah, what can I say, guys? Super happy. And we're going to continue, guys. I think I'm going to go for the 600kc today. And let's see what is going to be awaiting us. But finally, we get a juicy, juicy drop, guys. And from the KC number, what is it? 527, guys. We got ourselves another $5 drop. Uh, well, bond drop, guys. So we'll take that. And we managed to get ourselves another freaking Sardom in God's Word drop in the building, guys. KC 531. It's raining drops right now, guys. But unfortunately, we are not getting the desired Infernal drops. And we have reached KC number 550, boys. Elite all. Let's go. 50 more KC. We want to finish this collection lock finally. I swear to God. But yeah, the runs are going very clean. And we're getting some hella juicy drops. And this is going to be KC number 570, guys. And we are still without the required drops. You can't believe it. You can't make this up, honestly. No, Relic of Sardom. I mean, again, a Relic. Boys, why can I not get a Zamorak Relic? This makes zero sense, honestly. What the f And we are at KC number 590, boys. Another Sardamine Relic that we've got, and I just can't believe that we keep getting Sardamine Relics instead of the Zamorak one. It is really pissing me off, but it is what it is. Oh, 600 kills, guys. Again, we did not manage to get the collection log items that we needed, unfortunately. But we got the bow stuff, which is obviously huge. We're going to check out the chest, guys. And yeah, as you can see, the Sardamine Relics are stacking up. Infernal bow stuff, but look at all of these Relics. It's just so crazy, but it is what it is. Bye.